just pick what you're passionate about and become an expert in that with AI attached to it, and you've got a future that creates jobs and opportunities versus destroys it. So somebody's saying, well, John, isn't this the end of everything? No, calculators weren't the end of math. What calculator did was free you up from spending all that time. So now you had more time to then have highest and best use for your brain. So, so, the, so the internet didn't make you dumb. You have chat, you have chat GPT. You have, you, you have the smartest assistant on the planet in your pocket. Just simply say, this is John Hope Bryan. I need to do an op-ed or 800 words on this topic in my voice. And here are the framework. And I hit that three seconds. <laughs> and I read it, it was tripping. I was like, this is me. I said, what it? I said, this is plagiarism. No, it's me talking about me. But here's the good news. 99% of black people don't know a thing about AI. But to quote my brother Van Jones, 99% of white people don't know a thing about AI. <laughs> Like, this is equal opportunity discrimination. Financial literacy is a civil rights issue of this generation. AI literacy is a civil rights issue of this generation. You need AI literacy and financial literacy in God.